Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi taala wabarakatuh. Kyawan yan uwa da abu kanene internet ba ki daya barkan ku da warhaka barkan ku da zuwa Cyber Exploit Hausa. Naam. So insha Allah wa video mune wa uzamu tato na gama da hacking. Maana introduction to hacking ki na. Inda zamu gaba termuku da menene hacking. Wa nene haka. Musalong kuma haka sana dunia ba ki daya. Dan haka siya ku biyo mu chikin wana video. Do mangana chika kiam bayani gama da hacking. Do kuma wa nene hakas. Kamar yaw ke gani araya wa mutew da kullan kwanchi rayuwa ta dunia ba ki daya Aki nya zama ruwandari achikin al uma Inda aki kao kora pa kora pi Na chi wa mutani ana hakin nansu Ana hakin nansu misali Facebook nansu banki nansu Aka nya hakin waya ko kuma computer mutan Asa to anu bayan yu wande bisa an nya hakin ba sida ga baya Wanu maar ay hakin en na shi badi sa an nya hakin na shi ba So kei te da mu jiwe muga menene wanna hakin enda Aki tapata ake Now So Hakin aturan chida ye chiwa Hakin refers to activities That seek to compromise digital devices Such as computers, smartphones, tablet and even entire network Bima ana hakin Wens ayuka nida aki kadamar wa kon chida aki gudanar wa do mulalla ta digital devices that's na ura wa inda skit wa kida uta lan tariki ke na wa inda skit shapi computer wa yoi tablet do kuma network gaba ki da so wa inda ke na wa inda shini hakin atak ae che za wa inda chwa aturan che so but a hosan chedan inda chwa a pahimta na hakin ana na pun kuz ee ke na ka sa mwa ta kapa a chikin network ko kuma a chikin computer ka yu kuz ee ba tara da wa nang me a computer mbo kome wa nan me wa yamba ya san kashi ga wa nan network na so wa nan shi aki chiwa da hakin atak ae che so aka chiwa da chiwa hakin is a huge concern in cyber security apandan cyber security ma ana apandan kia ya na urori mas okwa lwa shi aki chiwa da cyber security sa roke na na Duwa na abadeisha po na ura It takes advantage of vulnerabilities in a computer system To provide sensitive information to the wrong people or organization Or to disable the operation of a group Anche ye kan do ki wata dama Ta yon kuse Matakara an samo vulnerability a chikin computer system Anche vulnerability wata kapachi konche wata hudachi Wanu hudine kukumanche Wanu wajini achikin komputa Wanda ba shida tsaro Wanda wanan Zee baya da dama asata Maya mamba ya nai Na aba mwa muta nanda Bika mata su samuwa namba ya namba Masali za iya hakin Gwomnet Gaba kita enta Ata taro wain su baya nai desiki Uwe wana siri wanda ba kuwa yaka mata ya gawa namba ya namba So za iya hakin nan su do mun samu wa namba ya nan Haka za lika kai dang adam za iya Kai normal mutin za iya hakin nan wain ka musali Ata nkana sevin nan musali banking details nka Abu bu baya nan ka wanda sika shapu banking ka Ko kuma wana kampan nka ko inda kiki aiki Ko kuma wana abu mahimmi agarika So di za iya yon kuse do mo asa towe nan bayanan so bayanan na za iya siyad da su a abanda ake chwe dark web so nan dark web ang ansiyar wanda aka siwa zi iya ampandi wa nan bayanan do mo nye ay watad do wana mugwa abu so nye su nza abu didigi aga waye ay watad do wana za iya zwa i trakin na ka akama ka a keba ka sammi ki pa ruwa ba kuma ba ka kewa na hakin nan ba so wana atak eche shini hakin so ke ila mo jemo gawa isa hanyo yi da ake bi do mo hakin Na farkuwa akwe ya bunda ki chwa social engineering and fishing Social engineering Wata hanyi achi ake bi Do mong Ay hakin Inde esha pi Haka zi zu Masali ya sa meka kai tse Yima wa instambu yui Wanda kai baka doka ku Yena ama tambu yui ni sebi da yena suwe sani Ala hali kuma yana suwe yana tambaya ni do mwenye sa mwenye subaya nega mada kai Do mwenye ay watar do wana mugu wang abu Agareka kukuma gawananka So haka zalika fishing Fishing kuma 
hanya ci wanda za iya creating link in aka creating link sai a tura muku a ce kai aba kaza ko kuma wannan link din idan ka danna shi zaka samu mb kaza ko zaka samu gig kaza ko zaku samu kudi kaza so idan ka danna wannan link din zai dauke ka zuwa wani page inda za a ce ka shigar da bayanan ka wanda suka shafi email address din ka password din ka ko kuma a bank details din ka da sauran su so ta nan in ka shigar da wannan bayanan shi wancan attack din zai samu wannan bayanan cikin sauki so wannan shi ake kira da phishing so kun ga ta kaice a fannin social engineering ba za iya hakin din ka ba sai da sai da sa hannun ka ma'ana ba za iya hakin din ka ba ba tare da kai ka sani ba sai dai a zo a ma wayo ko a ma wayo su da dabaru domin an sa bayanan ka ba tare da kai ka sani ba so wannan shi ake kira da social engineering and phishing abu na biyu shi ake kira da malware injecting devices a ko wani video da muka yi a karkashin channel din mu wanda muka kira shi da yadda haka suke satar bayanai suke satar username da password ma'ana bai ma'ana key logger kenan so mutum haka zai iya programming uh, uh, flash drive ya sa key logger a ciki zai iya zuwa ya sa a cikin computer ka uh, yana sa wannan device din a cikin computer ka to duk zai biya tattaro bayanan ka da abubuwa muhimmai a gare ka ya sace su ba tare da kai ka san me yake faruwa ba so wannan shi ake kira da malware injecting devices zai iya zama ta hanyar amfani da USB ko kuma akwai abin da ake cewa da USB rubber ducky so rubber ducky shi ma ya kan zo da key logger inda zai sa ta duk wani abu da aka shigar a cikin computer ka da hannu misali in ka shiga website din facebook.com zaka sa username din ka da password to wajen rubuta username da password din nan da zaran kana rubutawa shi keyboard din shi rubber ducky din nan yana nan yana recording duk wani harfa daya da ka rubuta so zai recording din shi storing din shi a database domin ya tura wa wancan attack din ko kuma attack din daga baya zai iya zo ya cire usb din ba tare da kai ka sani ba uh, so wannan shi ake kira da malware injecting devices abu na gaba shi ake cewa da missing security patches bi ma'ana akwai hanya da ake bi domin yin hacking wanda ya shafi update misali idan aka ce a uh, application ko wani website sun upgrade an uh, application din su so yana da kyau kai ma wanda kake amfani da wannan website din ko kuma kake amfani da wannan application din kai upgrade an cikin gaggawa domin maybe an an bar wani vulnerability ne a version din baya so in kai upgrade zai zo zai patchin wannan security din so ba ba, ba zai ba haka dama ba domin ya ai watar da abin da yake so ai watar so idan baka yin wannan regular update din da kuma upgrade na applications da kake amfani da kuma websites so kana cikin hadari to dan haka ta wannan hanya za iya bi domin ai hacking din ka ba tare da kai ka sani ba so yana da kyau idan windows misali kana amfani da windows operating system ne suka saki update so yana da kyau ka bi su kai tsaye kai ma kai wannan update din so abu na gaba shi ake kira da cracking password so mun yi wani video again muka ce yanda ake cracking password so ana yin cracking password using misali za a iya amfani da common python program domin a cracking password so akwai abubuwan da suka da suka hada da uh, abin da ake cewa da hydra akwai abin da ake cewa john the reaper duk wannan applications ne wanda ake amfani da su domin cracking password na database ko kuma na website gabaki daya so duk hanyoyi ne da ake bi domin yin hacking abu na gaba shi ake kira da distributed denial of service ko kuma a ce ddos so distributed denial of service hanya ce wanda ake bi ai hacking inda one shi haka din zai tsaya tsakiyan ka zai tsaya tsakiya tsakanin kai da kuma internet lokacin da kake so ka samu wani bayani a internet so shi kuma zai hacking din wannan website din ko kuma ya hacking wannan uh, server din bayan ya hacking din ta so duk wani bayani da kake zuwa zai je gare shi ne kai tsaye so sannan shi zai baka ansan da ya ya kamata so ta nan duk zai capturing duk wani bayanan ka da wani abubuwa naka domin ya hacking din ka so wayan nan a takaice su ne hanyoyi biyar da ake bi domin yin hacking kai tsaye so za mu je ga menene wane ne haka so wane ne haka kamar inda uh, aka ce anan a security hacker is someone who explore methods for bridging defenses and exploiting weakness in a computer system or a network haka mutun ne wanda yake zakulo hanyoyi da yake bi matakai matakai domin domin yin kutsi a cikin computer system ko kuma a cikin computer network duk wata hanya da ya san zai bi ya zakulo wannan 
weakness din ma'ana uh, rashin karfin security kenan zai bi domin ya samu wannan uh, vulnerability din wannan kafar da zata bashi dama ya shiga cikin computer ka har ma ya sata wannan bayanin naka da yake so ya sata so aka cigaba cewa in computer security a hacker is someone who focuses on security mechanisms of computer and network system haka mutun ne wanda yake wanda yake tsayawa tsayin daka a fannin security that's ma'ana a fannin tsaro na computer da kuma network uh, network system da kuma yadda network uh, computer take mu'amala da wata computer suke uh, sharing files suke exchanging abubuwa daban-daban so wannan shine haka a takaice so now abu na gaba shine za mu je mu ga ira-iran hackers kamar yadda kuka sani muna da three main types of hackers na farko su ake kira da black hat hackers na biyu su ake kira da white hat hackers sannan na karshe shi ake kira da gray hat hackers so su waye black hat hackers black hat hackers hackers ne kun ce masu yin kutsi ne wanda suke cutar da al'umma ina ce suna cutar da al'umma shine za su iya bi misali in sun yakin dan bankin ka su danga satan maka kudi ko kuma in sun yakin social network ɗanka su danga yaudaran mutane da shi ko kuma duk wani bayanai naka wanda suka sata su yi amfani da shi ta hanyar da bai dace ba so wannan su ake kira da black hat hackers na biyu su ake kira da white hat hackers white hat hackers hackers ne kun ce masu yin kutsi ne wanda ake daukan su a company domin su kare company nan daga sharran black hat hackers so abinda white hat hackers suke suna yi ne domin su taimaki ko kuma su kare wannan kamfanin ko wannan gwamnatin saboda kab black hat hackers su shiga su kutsiya su sata bayanai game da wannan kamfanin so white hat hackers ana biyan su kamar yadda kuka sani su suna yin abu ne na kirki asali ma suna yin hakin ne domin a biya su so abu na gaba shi ake kira da gray hat hackers gray hat hackers hackers ne wanda suka kunshi wanda suke yin aiki wanda ya shafi irin na black hat hackers da kuma white hat hackers idan na fada haka ina nufin hackers ne wanda idan sun samu aiki ne misali company ya zo ya dauke su aiki so za su iya hakin wanda ya shafi white hat hackers ma'ana za su kare wannan kamfanin daga sharin black hat hackers idan kuma ba samu aikin yi ba ko kamfanin nan ba zo sun dauke su aiki ba so za su iya yin hakin wanda ya shafi na black hat hackers ma'ana za su danga cutar da al'umma da kuma satan ma mutane bayanai da abubuwan da ba a rasa ba so wannan su ake kira da gray hat hackers so wannan su ne ira-iran hackers da muke da su guda uku so za mu je ga misalan hackers na duniya baki daya wanda suka shahara wajen hakin har ma an san da zaman su so kamar yadda kuke gani abu na farko haka na farko shi ake kira da Kevin Mitnick Kevin Mitnick haka ne wanda a yanzu shi ya koma white hat hackers ko kuma ya koma security consultant yana da company uh, na shi na kanshi uh, tunda yanzu kamar zan iya cewa ya zama uh, white hat hacker baya cutar da al'umma amma a da dai yayi so amma yanzu ya tuba sakamakon an kama shi a uh, yazo kuma ya gane cewa abin da yake yi ba daidai bane abu na uh, masala hackers na biyu su ake kira da anonymous anonymous wata kungiya ce ta hackers wanda suke yin abubuwa a uh, internet uh, wanda ya shafi kutsi wa gwamnati uh, gwamnatin kasa da kasa ko kuma gwamnati ta kasa guda daya ko kuma kamfani ko kuma wani abu ko kuma wani kamfani da ya shara ko mutun da ya shara so wannan su ne anonymous group ne na haka su wanda ba a san da su ba har yanzu ba za a iya ciwa ga mutun daya wanda yake shine yake da wannan group ba so mutun na gaba shi ake kira da Adrian Lamo shi ma haka ne wanda ya shahara so amma duk daga baya wayannan da an ci an kama su saboda sun fado fannin black hat hackers so daga baya kuma duk sun zo sun bi sun tuba so na gaba shi ake kira da Albert Gonzalez Albert Gonzalez shahararren haka ne na America amma asalin shi shi dan Israel ne so ya shahara wajen yin hakin inda yayi hakin wani kamfani da ake kira da TGX company a United States of America yayi hakin din abubuwa da dama wanda ya shafi satan satan credit card that's ATM card kenan information da wani abubuwa so wannan Albert Gonzalez din da kuke gani ya sata kudi a kalla estimates sun kai miliyan 360 dala kenan ba wai naira ba so an kama shi shi ma so amma duk daga baya sun bi sun tuba an sake su 
kuma ba sa yin wannan tasari sun koma white hat hackers so na gaba su ake kira da Matthew Bevan and Richard Price so su ma hackers ne wanda suke hacking ko kuma sun yi hacking an kama su amma duk dai sun tuba na gaba shi ake kira da Jonathan James Jonathan James ya shahara wajen hacking din website da dama wanda suka shafi kamfanonuwa na United States of America wanda duk da gaba dai an kama su su ma sun tuba na gaba shi ake kira da Astra Astra uh, mutun daya ne amma daga baya zo ya hadu da wani mutane wanda ba a san da su ba har yanzu an ki bayyana ko su su waye so amma dai su ma an kama su an ci taron su da sauran su na gaba shi ake kira da Edward Snowden Edward Snowden haka ne wanda shi ma dai yanzu ya zama white hat haka ya fita daga black hat haka kenan inda yana taimakon kamfanonuwa da dama wajen gano suwa yi black hackers da kuma kare wannan kamfanin daga security bridges da sauran su so wayannan su ne masalan hackers na duniya baki daya so idan kuka lura a cikin wannan bayanan da muka yi game da hacking mun dan tattauna game da illar hacking ne a musamman a wajen misalan hackers din nan na duniya so mu abin da zamu dinga koyarwa a wannan channel din ba zai shafi illegal hacking ba ma'ana abin da zamu shine ethical hacking hacking ta hanya mai kyau hacking na legal way ma'ana wanda an yadda da shi gwamnati ta yadda da shi to da zamu dinga koya muku abubuwa game da yanda zaka kare kanka daga wannan attacks din da kuma yanda zaka iya yin hacking misali kai testing din a network ɗinka domin uh, ganin security network ɗinka in kana da company ka san to aina ne kake da matsala aina ne kake da uh, na kasu da sauran su to so, insha Allah da wannan ne zamu kawo karshe wannan video idan kai sabo ne zuwa channel din mu mai albarka muna roban ka da ka yi like in video nan sannan kai share din shi zuwa ga abokanan ka domin su ma su amfana sannan muna roban ka da dan Allah kai dan na subscribe idan wannan shine farkon zuwan ka wannan channel mai albarka idan kuma kun kasance tare da mu a wannan channel muna godiya da gudun mu wanda kuke ba mu na kallon bidiyoyin mu sannan kuma muna roƙon ku da ku share wannan bidiyon domin wai su su ma su amfana idan kuna tambaya ko wani karin bayani ko mu yi wani kuskure da kuke ganin ya kamata ku sarara mu za ku iya fada mana a can comment section ko kuma a cikin links za mu bar shi a cikin description so da wannan ne insha Allah za mu ce assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh peace